Hello, welcome to the video. In this video, we solve exercise number 4-27. In this exercise, the non-emergency department treats the patients and patients arrive according to the exponential inter-arrival time distribution with mean value of 11 minutes. Upon arrival, they check in at a registration desk staff by a single nurse. And the registration time follows a triangular distribution with parameter of 6, 10, and 19. And upon completion, they wait for the available examination room. And there are three identical rooms. And data shows that the patient divides into two groups with regard to the different examination time. The first group patients have 55% chance. For the service that follow the triangular distribution with its parameter of 14, 22, and 39. And the second group means the 45% of the patient has the triangular distributed service time with parameter of 24, 36, and 59. And upon completion, patients are sent home. And the facility is open 16 hours each day. And you need to make 200 independent applications on the one day and observe the average total time patients went in the system okay move to the arena home screen and put a create flowchart module and rename it as create patient arrivals and entry type is patient or the arrival patient and the time between arrival is random as for well. its value is 11 minutes as prescribed in the problem statement and entries per arrival is equal to one then insert a process module and rename it as check-in and the action is cease delay release and add a resource that is check in nurse and you need to cease release is equal to one and it is triangular distributed with its parameter value of 6 10 and 19 and put okay okay now insert our decide module and rename it as determine patient type and under the type select the two way by chance and person true value is 55 percent mean Type 1 of patient 55% chance has their different service time and rest of the patient like 45% of the patient group has different processing time as mentioned in the case problem. 55% of the first group of patient follow the triangular distribution with its parameter of these and the remaining second group like 45% of the patient follow different service time. So that's why we need to put a decide module at this stage and after that we are going to uh, add the attribute using the assignment module simply insert the assignment module and rename it as assign patient type 1 treatment time attribute and click its add button and click the type attribute and rename the attribute name as treatment time and its parameter value is triangular 14 22 and 39 you can easily add the attribute using the attribute spreadsheet i will also be discuss uh, this concept later on okay so you can also define the attribute under this assignment module uh, okay and then simply right click build click build expression and under this build expression move to the random distribution and select the triangular distribution and then put their parameter values here so in this way you can write the proper expression of the required distribution in other case you can also type here as well then click ok and then again click ok and now again add the assignment module and rename it as the assign patient type 2 treatment time attribute and again repeat the same step for the attribute simply read all the attribute that you defined in the previous step that is the treatment time but here you need to add the different service time that is also triangular distributed but with different parameter values click ok and then click again ok then add an other process module and rename it as the patient treatment and the action is cease delay release and add the resource as the exam room and you need to see this one and under the delay type replace by default type 2 expression and here under the expression add the treatment time simply right click the build expression and here move to attribute 
value and here you can see the attribute that is defined in the previous steps then click ok and then click again ok and the process module is completed then add the dispose module and rename it as the go home okay so under this attribute spreadsheet you can also define the attribute that is the treatment time if you define here then you don't need to type the attribute name here if you type the attribute name here then this uh, step automatically be done so it's up to you or the user choice either you can define the attribute under the attribute spreadsheet or you can also define the attribute at the assignment module stages okay and uh, the resource capacity for the check-in process is one but the exam room capacity is three so replace its value from one to three and the queue length is first in first out that's it now you need to add the resource animation so simply click this resource animation button and define the identifier that is check in nurse or made idle and busy replication as white and also make sure the seize area check mark is checked then again add another resource that is exam room and under the idle simply copy these bosses two times that represent the three exam rooms for the idle case and for the busy stays as well and when and then click the C's area and then simply click OK so this one is for the patient treatment and this one is for the check-in OK move to the run setup and made 200 applications of the application length of 16 hours and 24 hours per day and then click OK OK so it's done now click this run button to run the simulation and make sure you select the entity picture as picture dot person so that when you run the model you can see different type of patients are coming in the system all right let's fast forward it all right it's done let's click this yes button all right so the average time patients spend in the system is 103.96 minute and that concludes our exercise 4-27 thank you